Crammel, this is my gentleman, this is fun with Akima, and these are our two concepts, Tired Out and Avalanche Buster. So many Americans, myself included, are unaware of what a good, sustainable tire looks like. Some people may know, but are far too busy or distracted to periodically check the wear of their tire. Failure to recognize a worn tire can result in sitting on the side of the road, being out hundreds of dollars because the tow costs, car repairs, and so on. So the specific problem we wanted to look at was people's unwillingness or forgetfulness to check the tread on their tires. And we plan on solving this by using the smart skin in building it into the tires, putting it in the wall and underneath the tread of the tires to detect when the tire tread is getting too low. There's already a tire pressure monitoring system in place that in some tires that sends signals to the cab, which we can just hook up the uh, smart skin to that system and it would be implemental in an easy way, efficiently. Uh, there are definitely other kinds of smart tires out there that people have been working on, but none of them use the smart skin to their advantage. They use a different system of nodes, and computer chips to send the information. Using the smart scan would be a more cost efficient way to get that done. Avalanches, as we all know, are dangerous and inevitable natural disasters that can happen every month. Measures are taken to prevent these natural disasters, like snow packing or creating smaller avalanches, but these techniques are outdated. So the specific problem is avalanches and the cost that they incur, human cost as well as financial costs. And our idea for this would be using the bunker busters and putting them in the ground on mountains and stuff and using their seismic wave activity in two different ways. The first way is you can send out low uh, frequency waves to just pack the snow down and uh, make it more dense to reduce the chances of an avalanche. But you can't always reduce them, avalanches are going to happen. And controlled avalanches is another way of preparation to prevent the bigger ones. And in that case, you use the high frequency of the seismic waves to create an avalanche that is under your control. Uh, the reason why this is better than what's out there is because right now they use people and just put packing, and they also use big machines to pack down the snow. And for the explosive ones, they use guns or just plain explosives to get it out of there. This would keep people and machines out of the way of danger and reduce the cost or reduce the potential danger to them. And, uh, and to the environment. So in conclusion, for our tired out idea, it would be more cheaper and more efficient than the regular smart tire that's out there today. It'll cause many people to be more aware of how their tires are doing so that they can uh, prevent uh, bad accidents happening in the future. For our avalanche buster idea, it would be more environment uh, friendly and safer uh, for, for people. And it would um, prevent more larger avalanches to happen and it will save uh, many people's, many more people's lives in the, in the each year.